Hey folks, I thought I'd do another um, random waffle about the reflections of an isolated extrovert. I've suddenly realised that I've been spelling extrovert and introvert the wrong way and it's got an O rather than an A. So sorry about all you uh, all you grammar buffs out there. Um, many people will notice and have noticed for years that my grammar and typing, I mix letters up and my proofreading is not the best. But anyway, uh, at least talking into a mic, I don't have to worry about spelling a word wrong. I just have to realise of saying it wrong. Hey, I've noticed one thing in this isolation, eh? I'm not spending as much money. You know, I'm not popping into a shop. I'm not popping down to Bunnings, not doing this. And uh, um, most of the things that are on my, on my account are supermarket things at the moment. So, yeah, it's probably a good thing. You know, you, you get to the point you realise that that shirt that you thought was wearing out or those running shoes you thought were no good anymore, you're still using them and you're thinking, ah, oh, Maybe I don't really need the things that I need when I need to buy those things. So I'm um, not popping into great outdoors in Fokatani or hunting and fishing and uh, going on Trade Me to have a look at hunting stuff. And I probably said Trade Me wrong again. My kids will laugh at me on that one. But, um, you know, we're doing okay and uh, ticking along. I, I, I wonder whether the introverts now are getting a whole pile of energy. And if each extrovert and introvert is about how you re-energize yourself, then I imagine the introverts are getting a whole lot of energy. Maybe not. Maybe because they're stuck at home with family, energy's been drained out of them. The extroverts must be getting all worn out because they haven't got anyone to go and talk with. But, you know, it's the way that it is, isn't it? And it's the way that we, we, we're ticking along. So spending money. We're not spending as much money as we did whereas the economy the government wants us to spend money so maybe i'll start having a look at aliexpress now and see what i can spend this hard-earned money i just have my wife rolling the eyes at me at, at the moment um thinking about putting my tent up outside and just cruising in the tent getting that outdoor experience so we'll see see what's happened and then um, then Joss is looking around the house thinking, I think I'd like a new fence. So we just measured the fence yesterday. It's 80 metres long if we were to replace our whole fence. There's some parts where we've got to do it, but that's going to be pretty costly. But so I guess the good reason is, is we're not spending money now because we might have to, ch we, might, I might, we might be forced to change a fence later on. <laughs> so it's all fun and games, isn't it? Great weather. I mean, in some ways... It would be better for our country probably if it was pouring with rain and full of storms in regards to keeping people inside but the other side of the coin it's nice to go outside i heard that you shouldn't be 750 meters away in a rural town but i haven't heard that officially i've just seen that through blogs so i'm not sure what that's what's what that's all about but we have a great opportunity here i know some of you don't of getting out near water which is always a good thing so kind of those are my reflections at the moment, saving a bit of money. Um, I also am aware that there are people out there that maybe don't have the money anymore to save. And so my thoughts are with you if you're um, struggling with jobs and, and all that sort of stuff. I think that the wage subsidy has been a great idea. Um, um, might have to sort it out later on, but um, but it's good. And also... I guess it's tax time coming, so I've got to do a bit of tax for when we rent our house out. So um, I've got to sort that out, take the opportunity. Anyway, I hope things are going well with you guys. Um, I hope you're saving money. Um, hope you, uh, you're you doing all right. Hope you'll be able to get to the grocery shop and keep that, that food going. And again, heads up and thumbs up for all those essential people who are working so hard. We appreciate what you do and appreciate um, all the effort that you're putting in. Anyway, God bless you all and we'll catch you later. See ya.